Hey, Chef Jeff here at White Apron Catering in Lake Worth. Um, gonna do something today for you. We're gonna do some tuna burgers. This is always fun. You wanna do something different. You're doing burgers on the grill. You got something you wanna mix it up a little bit, add. We're gonna do some tuna burgers. You can do them with your hot dogs, whatever. So I've just got some nice tuna. I've gone ahead and chopped this up, chopped some up already. You see that's already chopped and we've got a little more. Basically, you just take your tuna, you can chop it. I'm gonna chop it by hand, just cause I like to. Um, you can also run it through your, if you got one of those KitchenAid or one of your mixers, you run it through the, uh, the grinder attachment. Do it on the coarse grind. Um, you can even put it in your, you know, Cuisinart or food processor and just pulse it, but don't get it too fine. You don't really want it mush. You wanna have some pieces. All I do, you just take and do little thin slices one way, You know, do some of those. We'll stack these up and we just, you're making little, basically making little sticks, little match sticks from it. We're just gonna slice it up and then turn it the other way. And so you're just doing like a little dice all together. Yeah, so you just wind up with a little dice. You know, you want it to be a little bit small. You don't want to do, do too big of pieces because by chopping it up small, you're also going to be, the proteins are going to be allowed to keep it all together once it once you put it on the grill. And that's important because you don't want it to all fall apart. Now when we grill these, certainly you grill it however you like it, but I think you're not really going to want to grill them too much. We're going to keep them nice and rare, maybe mid-rare, but we're going to, you know, depending on how you like your tuna, of course. So we'll just give it a little mince. And again, it's got a nice, nice consistency there, and we'll just add it to the rest of this. And then we're just going to season it up a little bit. You could throw it on there just like that, but why not season it up and make it, you know, if you're doing it, Make it the way you like it. So, I'm gonna add to this a little bit of shallots. We've got some just diced shallots. We've got some red pepper, just some sweet little red peppers that I've diced up. Um, a little bit of pickled ginger. Got a little cilantro and a little chives. Now, to this, we're gonna add a little bit of salt. I do a little sea salt in there. And a little ground pepper. And then I do a little sesame oil too, just a little bit. And the sesame oil is gonna help bring everything together as well as it's gonna help it bind as well. And then from here, we're just gonna mix it all up. And then we're gonna patty out little burgers. Now, Size your, size your burgers with how hungry you are and what kind of buns you've got. I've got some little slider buns we're gonna do today just because I think that's fun. And so that's what we're doing. I'm gonna season this up, get it all mixed, and then we're just gonna patty it up. You patty them up, you can let them sit for a minute or they're, once they're pattied, they're ready to throw right on the grill. So. Okay, and I've got just a little pan here, scoop to help make things easier. And I've just got a little mold that I'm using. It's just a little ring mold or cutter or, you know, biscuit cutter or whatever you're gonna use. So I do that and I'm gonna take just a nice scoop, kind of patty it in. And then from there, just kind of push it into the little mold. Now certainly you could free form those as well and they do just as good. There, look at that, beautiful. So we're gonna get a few of these patted up and then get them ready to throw on the grill. All right, 
So we've got these all patted out. I'm going to season them up. I used a little black and spice on this. So we're not really staying Asian. We're just, we're just going with a good burger. Season them there. And I'm going to just spray them with a little spray, a little olive oil or pan spray or whatever you're working. I'm going to throw them right on the grill. And again, these aren't going to need much. We're going to get those going and see how they do. We'll season up this other side. And you see them, they're starting to go. You see how they're starting to cook through. Again, we don't want them to cook all the way through. So now we're ready to give these a little flip. Let's see how they're doing. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. They're a little bit more delicate than a regular burger. All right, and then we'll let them cook on that side. And at this point, we're just gonna get everything ready and we'll start making up some burgers. Got some fixins, got some lettuce and tomato and avocado. Got a little mustard mayonnaise and ketchup. Got our little slider buns. And now we've also got, I'm gonna make up some mayonnaise. I've got some mayonnaise, but I've got some little wasabi, so. All right, these are about ready. Look at that, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, that one fell apart a little bit. Might have a little casualty here and there. About ready on that. We're just gonna slide this over, give us some room. All right, so now we're ready for our burgers. We've got a little wasabi. I made up some wasabi earlier. Let's make a little wasabi mayo up for our, uh, for our burgers. I like that on mine. Now, can you just have your burgers the way you usually have them with the ketchup and mustard? Absolutely but why not have them with a little wasabi mayo? So, we are ready. So we got some burgers. We're gonna make up a couple real quick. What do you think? Let's do, how about a little wasabi mayo on there? Be a little red onion, slice of tomato, some avocado, a little fresh ground pepper and salt under there, and a little piece of lettuce. There you go. How about that for a slider? How about that for a slider? Just to show you what it looks like on the inside, you've still got the nice rare tuna, and then you've got the lettuce and tomato and all that. Good to go. That's how we like to do them here on the grill. Fresh ahi tuna burgers. Let's see what we got. Mmm. That works. Chef Jeff here at White Apron Catering, Lake Worth, 561-585-2985. Thanks for watching. Go ahead and subscribe, like us. We'll see you next time.